So in this video, we are going to see that how to use a Spectrum email with a third-party client like uh, Outlook. It's real simple and easy. You don't have to go through a, a lot of steps. Luckily, Outlook is a smart client. It uh, go online and brings up the settings for you automatically so it's taking time So you can say, so I have already an account that is my other account. So these clients, you can uh, connect multiple accounts with them. So all you have to do is, oh, okay, lunch. This one is dismiss all. So this is a very good thing, like it gives you all of your notification as well so from here you can add another account as well from this button so or you can toggle between settings like for the account information if you have more than one I will come back here and show you but to add an account you have to come here if it's the first time you will see just a screen which will ask you for all the username and path for your email address and the password that will be exactly like this one you don't have uh, for, forget the background it will be just this asking you what is your email address so you will provide so it could be any email that is from spectrum uh, it could be at cincy.rr.com it could be this one uh, twc.com so any address that is from spectrum or so old time honor old bright house or what's the other one old charter so you see it's saying adding i wc.com what's happening is that it is going to the our server and spectrum and getting the information what is the outgoing server what is the incoming server what force to use so if i can go back and show you this is the advanced option so you can set up an account manually but since it's doing automatically we don't have to and I checked uh, today they were like uh, like uh, I checked it uh, from the browser so let me add my password again this this keyboard is not good so two buttons if I press it together mail.twc.com yep that's the server right and press OK so it's adding it and hopefully it goes and brings in the settings oh I made a mistake here I put my wrong email address so now it should work see quickly so account successfully added Even though it's saying I Hamid, it should be I Hamid dot twenty one. So let's go say done. And yep, these are all the junk emails that I saw. So right here, it's showing me my email address, and so these are the inboxes right here that which inbox you want to go to so they will show up here so this one is the other account this one is the, my uh, TWC account but the email address is wrong but that's just the name right now this one is a name you could do change it like uh, right there TWC can I change it no it's grayed out all right so 
from here if I click it you see it's the inbox and it has 45 emails and then there is another one that has the email on the server it needs to sync and then I have this one this needs to sync because I did uh, the password is changed but this one is right there I have made dot uh, org so this one has 25 so this is how you toggle between the email inboxes you have so you click over here and it loads the settings for you here and you go to inbox and it shows you all the email and it's it was pretty quick to download 45 so so from here if you delete them they will be deleted from your uh, should be deleted from your server as well since it's IMAP so let's go and uh, let me show you that uh, account as well so you see over here these are these settings so these settings are right now at this one for account setting connection setting so you see this is IMAP SMTP simple mail transfer protocol internet messaging access protocol this is Microsoft Exchange so this one is different than this uh, TWC so on and so forth so <clears throat> oh it's, it was showing me something that I need to see that is not related to you but uh, the OST so it's Microsoft in data file Microsoft Outlook has learned all right all right so this is how you add the uh, TWC account uh, email account to your Outlook or any third-party client for that matter if you if you like this video please rate comment subscribe and share and I see you in the next one